mentioned earlier uh, two, your two predecessors, uh, Pat Mitchell and, and Irvin Dugan, and he said something that I, I wanted to run past you because he left after five years, and he said it was because of the wear and tear. He said living in an intensely political atmosphere where PBS was treated often as a political football. And then he also talked about the constant temptation in the system to imitate the commercial TV industry, to run commercials, to do programming that is designed to attract big audiences rather than be true to our public service mission. And I'm wondering how great that struggle is today. Well, you know, I think there's always a tension um, in a media organization, and we talk about this a lot within our system, of the, really the tension as, you know, because we are mass media, so we do want to reach an audience, and particularly for children, I really do care how many children we reach, because the content that we're producing is not because I'm trying to sell, you know, you know soda pop to kids, uh, which, is a, which is someone else's business. What I am trying to do is to make sure that every child has has access to content that is really going to expand their mind and really help them, particularly as they get ready to enter school, you know, with these basic skills. And so, you know, you want, you need to develop programs that children will want to watch, but that also have the curriculum embedded in it. With the content for adults, it's the same thing. I really do want to find programming that is different and unique and is important. Um, and, but I also want to make sure that, you know, we're reaching more than five people, right? And so, I, you know, we don't let ratings rule what we do. I mean, we would make very different decisions. You would see, you know, different types of programs on every night if that was the case. But what I do want to do is, is, is very much a balance. So there are programs in the schedule that I know when we put them on probably aren't going to get a really big audience, but for the audience that are coming, it's going to be a very important program. And so it's that constant balance that we have to pay attention to. So I think Irv's comments are really important, that it is always attention and it is always really paying attention to um, not going down that slippery slope of just picking programs just because you know they're going to be popular, but really that blend of programs that have wider audience appeal. It's the Downton Abbey, which I'm very proud of. It's the front lines, which I'm enormously proud of. It's that documentary film that is on an impactful subject that, you know, all of that is part and parcel of the whole fabric of what we're brought, bringing to the American public as part of PBS.